A balloon has a mass of 10 gram in air. The air escapes from the balloon at a uniform rate with a velocity 4.5 cm per second. If the balloon shrinks in 5 seconds completely, then the average force acting on that balloon will be okay in time. Okay. So if you are to visualize this, um, you know, this question here. So this piece of balloon here of mass 10 gram is going up and the velocity is 4 point, the, the velocity with which the air is escaping is 4.5 cm per second. And as it moves off, we know that uh, since air is escaping, the mass of the balloon will reduce and eventually it becomes zero. And this complete transition from 10 gram to zero gram takes place at, uh, takes place in t is equal to 5 seconds. So the mathematical form to understand this is that f is equal to dp by dt, right? Which is equal to d by dt of d by dt of mb. So this is m into m into dv by dt plus v into v into dm by dt. So basically f is equal to m into dv by dt plus v into dm by dt. This is what we have as equation. Now, from this question here, it is given that the velocity is 4.5, 4.5 centimeter per second, which means velocity is a constant. And when velocity is a constant, dv by dt is equal to zero. Therefore, this term here vanishes, which means what we get is f is equal to v into, right? v into dm by dt. Therefore, f is equal to what is v? Velocity is 4.5, 4.5 centimeter per second into what is dm by dt? Change is 10 to 0, right? So, dm is equal to 10 and what is dt? This is taking place in 5 seconds. So, dt is 5 seconds. Therefore, this is 10, uh, what is the unit? 10 gram, 10 gram per second. Now, why am I emphasizing on unit this, you know, this much is because of the fact that it is asked in time. So F becomes 4.5 into um, time is 5 seconds, right? So it is 5 seconds. So 10 by 5 is 2 into gram centimeter per second into second is second. So gram centimeter per second square. So what we get is F is equal to 9 gram centimeter per second square and what is gram centimeter per second square c one dyne one dyne is actually equal to 10 to the power minus 5 newton and one dyne is also one gram when accelerated through a acceleration of one centimeter per second square so this actually becomes f is equal to 9 what is gram centimeter per second square it becomes newton right sorry uh, it becomes it becomes Dine. So the correct option is force is equal to 9 times.